and welcome to my first and only video ever titled, What's in My Purse? You see, my niece has been watching these videos about what's in my purse, what's in my backpack, and you know, I think it would be a much better video to just be like, what's in my purse like right freaking now? So that's what we're gonna do. Brand, I don't give a crap. Let's, let's face it, when you're a mom, you don't even care about brand. You just comfort, size, is it gonna get the job done? Is it gonna be sturdy? How much does it cost for real? Okay, like I'm pretty sure I bought this at the Ross for less than $20 for sure. Okay, moving on. Here's my front pouch. I like having a front pouch because it get, it's a good place to put all the things that I need right away. For example, my little pouch that has cards. Yes, credit cards, debit cards, and my driver's license. Not gonna show you any more of that because you guys are the internet and that's weird. Another card. Pen, because that's important. And apparently a Starbucks gift card that my secret Santa just gave me. A receipt. A very, very stupid receipt that should just have been thrown away originally. Some crayons, because I grabbed a pack of crayons from a restaurant for my other niece, my much younger niece, and forgot to give it to her. Okay, moving on. Main pouch. A another receipt of no consequence that should have been thrown away. Ah! My Shutterfly order that I picked up at the Walgreens that shows my baby's birth announcement. I'm meaning to get these out to people soon, but I have not yet. So there they are in my purse. This is a little mini pouch thing that holds all of my you know, coffee cards, my library card, um, you know, random stuff like that. Store cards, coffee punch cards, whatever. Okay, Jolly Rancher, because why not? Sewing kit. I like to have a sewing kit wherever I go. It's pretty cool. I don't remember where I got this, but it was cheap. Because that's how I do. All right. Coin purse. You know, keep your coins somewhere. USB drive. I think everybody should have a USB drive in their purse. Hacky sack. Who knows? A stabilized bar. In case I get hungry. Extra random keys. Suntan lotion. Or sunscreen, sorry. Sunscreen. Another USB card. This one is a Kaiser Permanente one that comes with all kinds of information about having a baby. Got it when I was pregnant. Never looked at it. This is Alka-Seltzer because I was pregnant. Hand sanitizer. A memorabilia from a conference I attended. And Kaiser Permanente floss. Let's see. Moving on. Aha! I got this last Christmas. I should probably throw it out. But it's chapstick in case you didn't recognize the branding. Okay. An appointment reminder for a nail appointment I canceled. Hey. And random papers. Ah, here's the coloring book from the restaurant that, uh, you know, belonged to the crayons that I showed you earlier. A pay stub. Somebody's resume for daycare to watch my baby. A babysitter resume. Um, Bath and Body Works coupons. That's cool. Another receipt that I don't need. Ah, my ID badge at work. That's important. Fred Meyer coupons expired. And a uh, measuring tape. Because you just never know when you're going to have to measure yourself. Or somebody else. Oh, this is some, um, like, Christian pamphlet. This is a, uh, if you've got questions about evolution, pamphlet. Some more receipts. Ross receipts. This one's so old, it is literally faded to nothing. All you can see is a vague notion of Ross and a phone number that I wrote on top of it at one point. 
which I don't need anymore. Okay, more receipts, 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 receipts. <laughs> Be filled with God's peace. More coupons for McDonald's. More receipts. A journal entry, which should probably go with my journal somewhere. Checkbook, which has a very old student ID card on it from when I went to Corbin University. So that's cool. And a 2013-2014 year planner which it's 2015 and almost 2016. So this is very old, <clears throat> very expired. Of course, every lady should have some of these in a deep, dark pocket somewhere. I also have emery boards, which there's only two left on this little thing. But you know, that's good. Oh, hey, one more just in case. And some old used emery boards. So that's good. Here's a pin from some, I don't even know, some college thing that I did. There's a safety pin. You always need a safety pin. Okay, you don't always need a safety pin, but every once in a while you need a safety pin and it's nice to have. Oh, button. Random button. Okay, I've got some sanitizer stuck on this thing. It was a door prize that I got for going to a warehouse event. And then, because I'm a new mom, of course, I've got a little diaper thing. This is wipes. There's supposed to be diapers in here, but of course, you know, I've used the diapers. That's how that works. This is a breast shield, nipple shield, for when you nurse on the go. And here's a baby hat and another baby hat and a burp cloth. And that concludes my purse. Wait. Aha! A reminder <coughs> to pick up my pearls at the Shane Co. They were dropped off in July. It is December. That's how long my pearls have been in the shop simply have not had the time to go over there and get them. All right, well, there you have it. An actual real life what's in my purse video.